what's up you guys welcome back to my channel today's video is sponsored by wiggins hair so i got a pair of lashes elastic band a edge brush and a pack of wig caps so here is the wig you guys it is already pre-customized for you it does have the adjustable elastic band but you can see it's already pre-curled pre-bleached and pre-plugged showing you guys the hairline a little closer so here's the wig on my head again right out of the packaging haven't done anything to it look at the hairline that looks so good and so natural So I'm going to start by cutting off some of that lace that is going over my ears. I start at the bottom corner and then just cut up and go around my ear and cut it off that way. And I'm going to do the same to both sides. Here, I'm just taking some powder. This is a contour powder that I have, and I'm applying it directly on to the lace. I didn't want anything heavy like foundation, so I just used powder, really easy to apply. This wig is already really laid, so I'm just doing this just to be doing it, but I just went over the hairline with the hot comb, and I also went over the part line as well with the hot comb but again you guys can see for yourself how well this wig is already laid and pressed out I really wanted to take a break from lace glue and I also feel like this hair I didn't really need glue so I'm using some hairspray to secure the lace down I'm spraying it directly on top of the lace where the hairline is and then just pressing it in with my fingers I'm going to take the elastic band that came in the packaging and just tie that down and let the hairspray just air dry. So after letting that sit for maybe 10 minutes, I took the band off. I'm going to go ahead and cut the lace. So I always cut in the middle and then just cut one side at a time. So I like to cut in two sections. It just makes it easier for me. And as you can see, I'm making very small cuts and that's how I get my zigzag cut without creating like a straight line going across my forehead it just makes it more obvious so when you cut like that it helps hide the lace more So I wanted to close up the part some. I just took some mascara and I used the wand to help achieve that. I don't have hair dye spray, so I personally prefer to do it this way. I feel like I can do a better job without messing it up. And then here, I wanted to cut some layers around my face. So that's what I'm doing. I really only cut the bang area. I didn't do too much. I didn't want to mess up the curls or mess up the hairstyle so yeah i just really cut around the bangs so that it could frame my face a bit more and really compliment me 
I also want to mention I'm doing a no baby hair look with this hair just because the hairline is just so flawless and again it looks so natural I don't think the baby hairs are necessary I think it'll take away from the look So at this point, I'm pretty much done. I'm just making some final touch-ups. As you can see, going back in with that hot comb back over the hair, just making sure that it's really flat at the top and that it's molded to the shape of my head. So I began to start separating the curls and just using my fingers to do so. I like a loose curl look. I don't like super defined. And I'm going to take some of this anti-frizz serum and just apply it to my fingers. And then again, start separating and combing out those curls once again. And lastly, I spray some oil sheen, just give the hair some more shine and luster. And that is going to complete it, you guys. Really simple, really easy. I love that it saved me so much time on customizing this wig. So if you guys want the same look, I will have everything listed down below. So definitely make sure you check it out. Like, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Sub to my channel if you're not already. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for wanting a verse from me. Apologies for the wait. Sometimes it's hard to make the distractions up off you. For enough time to jot your thoughts. This morning I got to. I'm thinking about you. I heard you just had you another little baby. Congratulations. I hope you got through it with no complications. I find it amazing. The way that you juggle your kids, the biz, the fame, the bitch that's hating. They sit around waiting for you to fall off like the album I'm making. But I hope that you're taking a little time for yourself. Still in a moment or two to unwind Between the hectic sounds of your precious baby crying Do you hear your mind? Must be a lot going on I hear it in all of your songs It's been doing you wrong Barely been doing you wrong On days you feeling like you on your own I wrote this for you to put on Thank you for sharing your light, your voice And writing a beautiful poem Session 32, bring me to tears Be getting choked up when I hear it